Hi. Welcome back to our channel. Welcome back. Oh, there's socks. Oh, <laughs> there goes our light. And okay. Hey. <laughs> well, welcome back. <clears throat> welcome. Hello. How's it hanging? How's it going? Um. Can you not do that right now? <laughs> Sorry, we're having technical, technical difficulties, difficulties because my dog is just wanting to play so badly right now. So we thought you would like to <coughs> get to know us a little bit. Get to know us a little bit get better. To know what our channel's about, what we're about, all that good shit. What socks is about? <laughs> why she does that crazy shit? Right. How we met, our plans for the future, stuff like that. All that. Okay. All right. Let's get into, into it. it. I'm Hannah, and that's Hannah, Maya. Maya. I am 19 years old. I'm 20. As you guys fucking saw on my video the other day, if you have it, I'll link be, in the description. I'll be 20 in December. And then I'm about to be a sophomore in college. I'll, I would have been a senior in graduating, but I dropped out of college a while ago. <coughs> Um, I'm originally from Houston, Tejas, but I live here now. I'm here in Arkansas <laughs> all my life. What are you doing? Oh my socks! Go! Go over there! No. Okay, there you go. What are you doing? You cracked so it. It's my face! Okay. Alright, go no. over there. Go over there now, please. Thank you. Thank you. We don't care. Yeah. If we stay at our 20 subscribers, <laughs> go for it. If it goes to 2 million, 20 million, go for it. We're just yeah. here and happy to be here. Yeah, and we're definitely like, we want to keep this going for as long as we can. Um, obviously, we don't know what life is going to hold in the future, you know, but we are going to try to keep this up. So, yeah, we're here to stay for a while. For a while. <laughs> So we've been friends for like a really long time, but there was, I know there was at least a year where we went without seeing each yeah, other. Yeah, it was a while. Yeah, and so, or even after that, if it wasn't a year, it was like three months, it was, four it, months, like. We would go like weeks, months, years without seeing each other and other of our friends too. And yeah. we're kind of making this to one, see each other and two, right. see our other friends because we're obviously gonna include them in some of our other stuff right you know because and like it'll also like inspire us to go like do stuff do because stuff. both me and hannah like i'm in school and work and she's working and so like that's kind of the only things we do which is kind of sad yeah. <laughs> you know but like Loneliness. on purpose though right <laughs> but um but yeah so like we just need like a little kick yeah, little kick, and we just to need to we just need to get things. our creative energy out too. Because sure. like we can only do so much at our jobs because it's like controlled what right. we do with our creativity. Like, oh, make this look pretty, and it's like right. we'll have to make it look pretty to your standards, not my standards, and right. like stuff like that. And I can't fully be like or whatever at work and stuff like that. Right, and they're like, if you stray from the corporate vision, you will be taken out with our corporate sniper. Like, yeah, basically. You know, so we just uh, need a place to, yeah, our little outlet. Yeah, and it's also a way to meet new people for sure, and yeah, go to new places, places, trying new things. Yeah, so it's stuff like that. It's for the good mentality, the good brain, the good positive brain, positive vibes only. Positive, positive vibes only. <laughs> Okay, well, we kind of did that in the first question. Yeah. Um, oh, college majors. Okay, so I am gonna major in marketing and I'm going to minor in business management. As of now, I'm thinking I might, might thinking I might make minor in something a little bit more like creative driven because I feel like yeah. people in marketing like need something like that or like even just business in general like nowadays like if you only have business degrees they're like how dare you have the bare minimum requirements yeah. so like <laughs> you know we'll see but that's what it's at for now i work at a tj maxx home goods um <laughs> oh, what's up she has the goods i have the goods 
<laughs> um, when I was in college, I was a psych major, which was fun. I was going to minor in adolescence and stuff. Um, but I didn't know that actually. Really? really? School just wasn't for me. So, or at least at the time and now it's not. So we'll see. I have lots of ideas of where I could go and what I could do. So we both, we both love Cody Ko and Noma yes, Noah Miller. Noah Miller. I have been tell. a fan of Cody Ko since Vine. Like, yes, I'm so proud that I can say that, <laughs> that like he was my favorite Viner and now he's my favorite YouTuber. And it's like, I've been here since the beginning, bitch. And Big we time. both like David Dobrik and the vlog squad. Right, right. Because who does it? If you don't, you're an actual psychopath. <laughs> okay, and another one of mine is Video Game Donkey. Um, I'll have to show you some of his videos because yeah. they're so, like, even if you don't play video games, you can enjoy them because he's just so funny, but really well spoken, yeah. but like, you know how funny he can be. And so it's funny seeing him be well spoken, I guess. Okay. I don't know. I guess what you mean. Yeah. He's really funny. And he does like all types of video games, like, you know, like PC games, Xbox, PlayStation, you know, he does it all. Switch. Yeah. So, um, some of my other favorites. Which I get, I look like this girl all the time. <laughs> You're gonna know who I sit mm -hmm. say. Andrea Russett. People for years have been telling me that I look like Andrea Russett, and I can kind of see it. I kind of can't. There's certain features of ours that I could see if, like, we each had like a different like shaped something or something like that. But Perfect. and then uh, another or another one of. My favorite YouTubers. I actually just now kind of became a subscriber within like the past two months, but her name's Jackie Ina. She's a makeup artist. Is she the one. one that does the crazy makeup and can make herself look like somebody else? No. Oh, there's some <laughs> other girl that can, that's been around for a while. I mm -hmm. used to subscribe to her. I don't think I am anymore. No. But I mean, she's still like, she's really good at makeup and she does like color combinations you would like never ever expect and she makes it look so like good. Yeah. <laughs> So, um, she's one of my favorites. Oh, another one is, she's also a makeup artist, um, Desi Perkins. I love her. I did, I, I, I did my her. spring formal makeup after one of her videos, and I did one of her Halloween videos for my Halloween costume. Oh, um, the skull that was melting? Mm -hmm. That. Uh, that, like, she did that, yeah. so that's what I did for Halloween. Um, I love Sam and Colby, and, like, that whole TFIL group mm -hmm. with, like, Elton. I love Elton. I watch every single one of their um, New Zealand videos. Oh my gosh, I've been watching all of their- Because yeah. right now they're doing a series with- It's Elton, Sam and Colby, mm -hmm. Andrea, and Corey. Yeah. And then they every once in a while add that one um, big buff black dude that they always hang out with. I don't yeah. remember his name. <coughs> and then that other guy that always does parkour. I can't remember his name either. But they've been like thrown in there. But it's mainly mm -hmm. them right now. Yeah. And I've like been obsessed with TFIL. I'm like so ready. For their new videos. Yeah, Elton also does like a lot of things for charity. So that's yeah, cool. he does. He's awesome. But yeah. Um, I also like Tana, Shane, and because of Shane's new video, I started watching Eugenia Cooney. She is the sweetest person on the planet. I want to just go up to her and give her the biggest hug and just be like, I love you. Um, I also like Jeffrey, Jenna and Julian. Jenna and Julian are like, I love oh. Jeffrey. I love Jeffrey, I love Jen and Julian, and I also have Hannah Malosh on there because I watch her. I have no idea who that is. She's an Emma Chamberlain's friend, but I don't really like, I used to like Emma, mm -hmm. but then her- I used to really like her, and then- Then something weird happened, like, she moved to LA. That's literally what it was, That's... when she moved to LA. <laughs> and I hate saying that because, like, everyone's like, oh no, she's the same, not- mm -mm. And I'm not like hating on her at no, all. No, no, I mean, I like, still, she seems to be happy, so go off. Yeah, and, and like, I still watch some of her videos when I think that they're worth watching. Number one, Tom Holland. Love my Spider Man. I love Tom Holland. And he's about to be in a new movie series um, called Chaos Walking. Ooh, and they're my, good. it's my favorite fucking book series of all time. It's so good. And I found out Tom Holland and Daisy Ridley are the two main characters. And I oh, was like, oh, that'll be good. So, Tom. Um, I like Jennifer Aniston a lot. <clears throat> I don't know. She's, <laughs> she's always been like in movies ever since I was a kid and like TV shows. Right, she's been around for a long time. Yeah. Like I grew up watching Friends. 
So yeah. like she was, and everyone loves Rachel. You know, she's hot as fuck. So like, you know, I can't help but I'd say her. Um, Brooklyn Nine-Nine is one of my favorite TV shows of all time. It's so funny. But it gets really, like, I've cried at a couple episodes. Like, it's really funny without them being, like, the family guy type of funny yeah. where they have to offend everybody, you know? And don't get me wrong. <laughs> That's really funny. I love really funny. people. <laughs> I love offending people. But, like, people. like, when you watch a TV show where they don't make... Offensive jokes and It's like completely that. different. Yeah, and it's, it's still, so like, it's so, it's so funny. But it's also, like, really serious, though. Yeah. B99. So, obviously, Friends is one of my favorites. So, I'm going to say Stranger Things is another one of my favorites. For sure. Love Stranger Things. The Good Things. Place. The Good Place is funny. We both loved Supernatural for a really long time. <sighs> we were huge fans of Supernatural. For, for literally, I think it was in season maybe four or five when we started watching yeah, it. Yeah, together, yeah. And then now it's at season 15 is the next season. But we, I mean, I... We stopped a few right. years ago. But I ended up watch, going back to watching the seasons that I hadn't watched anyway because I was like, I want to know what they're up to. I so. I keep wanting to, but then I'm like, should I? Yeah, and then I used to be a really, really big fan of The Walking Dead. And that. then I just like stopped watching. It wasn't because like I wanted to. I just did, you know, it wasn't really on purpose. But see, I love Blake Lively and I love Gossip Girl. So I'm putting those together. <laughs> um, I also love The Fosters and Good Trouble, the shows. Um, and there's two girls from there that I really, like, I follow really closely, like Maya Mitchell and um, Sierra Ramirez. Mm -hmm. I love them. Um, I love Jamila Jula. I think that's her name. Yeah. No, J Jamila Jamil. Um, she's in The Good Place. She plays um, Tahani. She plays Tahani. Oh, Tahani, yeah. So first of all, hot. Cute accent. She's so pretty. But she just, like, the way, what she speaks out about things is, like, so important, you know? And, like... She is um, so much different than everybody else who's kind of like everyone else seems like they're forcing it on you But she's yeah. just very graceful about it. Yeah Also, she like when she was younger like she was in a wheelchair. She like had an eating yeah. disorder She or she was you know, she was all these she had lots of problems. Yeah um, John Mulaney So like I don't really watch a lot of like comedians like Netflix specials, you know, mm -hmm. I just Sometimes it's just hard to me to sit down and listen to people. Yeah. <laughs> and so, but then like I started seeing things about this John Mulaney, and I was like, and then I started watching, and then I was like, oh my god, I love him. I even once stood outside. It was like 40 degrees outside. It was raining. It was dark. I stood outside for four hours to get a ticket to see him. Jesus Christ. Yeah. That might have been a little much, but I didn't put this down. But seeing Anna Sophia's Rob name on my celebrity list made me remember how much I loved Hulu's The Act with Joey King. Also, <laughs> I like um, Karen Chirka. She plays Sabrina in the Sweet Chilling Adventures of Sabrina. And Zendaya, of course. I love Zendaya. I have Millie Bobby, Bobby Brown on here. I have Zendaya as well. Let's see. Um, Angelina Jolie. I love Angelina. She's so gorgeous. She could slap me and I'd tell her to do it again. <laughs> um, and other shows I like is That 70s Show. I love Shameless. I love That 70s Show. I Shameless love that show. Shameless is right up there with Friends for me. Like, I'm so sad that Shameless's last season is this season. And then Grey's Anatomy because... Ugh, love Grey's Anatomy. I don't even want to talk about Grey's Anatomy. <laughs> oh, also Attack on Titan. Oh. I just forgot about me that. Off. I completely forgot that show existed. <laughs> Lizo. Oh yeah. Jeremy <laughs> likes that song. <laughs> he goes, I this is the first time I've ever heard it. I was like, have you been on Instagram lately? Marina and the Diamonds, or she's now just known as Marina. Marina. Love her. Uh, I wanna go to one of her concerts so bad. Billie Eilish. I wanna go to one of her concerts so bad. Um, Halsey. I had tickets to Halsey mm -hmm. last year, and Jeremy and our old roommate fucked me out of going. Damn. Post Malone. I have Post Malone, too. Lord. I like Lord. She was just dropping in the fucking album. Yeah, no. It's been years. I like Schoolboy Q and Kendrick Lamar. Um, I like The Black Keys, Red Hot Chili Peppers, The Vaccines. If you really know me, you know I love G. <laughs> 
I still listen. I listen to his old stuff because his new stuff is garbage. Oh, Shoreline Mafia. That shit slaps. I love Khalid. Khalid for oh. sure. And the chain smokers. I like EDM and stuff like that. I like John Bellion a lot too. I like some of his songs. I like his older stuff. Some of his other stuff is just. His new album's kind of weird. Black Bear's My Daddy. You gotta say that. You gotta be horny on me, huh? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. Um, Black Bear is. Oh, oh. That man could sing me to sleep every night. I would let him. And then, of course, Miley Cyrus is one of my favorites, too, as, you know, from when I was a kid up until now. Hannah Montana, Miley Cyrus, now Ashley O. <laughs> okay, um, my big thing for now, well, I have two. One is to possibly get a job in marketing already or, like, a job that could lead me to marketing easy. And then the next one is to graduate college, so... And then get a job in marketing immediately and move to a bigger city. Faux show. Probably back to H Town. I feel that. For me, Ooh. it's probably finding a, either a better job or advancing at my current job, which I've already started doing. So, and then probably get married. That's one of the next things on the list. Um, move once we get married to a bigger city or another anywhere <laughs> from away from here um and then buy a house and start career wherever yee 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 i can't believe i just fucking did that <laughs> me and him <laughs> for sure if you don't know who that is, I'm not going to explain it because you should just be ashamed of yourself. And if she does, she'll go on an hour tangent about her. <laughs> Stanley, rest in peace. Mm. I'm not Catholic, <laughs> but Jamila Jamil again. Yeah. Brie Larson. I know a lot of people think she's like hella arrogant and I, I mean, she... I like her. She's brash. Mm. Some of the people, I don't really, it took me forever to figure out the answer to this question because I don't really look at other people and try and like be like other people or like try and model my life after something that somebody else has done. But if I were, I would probably pick like Billie Eilish and like Selena Gomez. Yeah. Okay, I don't know. I know we, it was both, it was algebra class. Yeah. Um... I think you might have been, I think I was 13 and you were 14. Yeah, I think we I think that's what it was. We figured that out. And then, um, we also played soccer together. So we were together, like, all the time. All basically. the time. And um, her mom coached the soccer team and my cousin, her cousin coached the soccer team. So yeah. we always ended up hanging out and yeah. everything, like, all the time. She was, like, my first friend when I became homeschooled. <laughs> and I was like, ah, uh, and then, like... <laughs> uh, and we played a little bit of volleyball together before. Oh, yeah, we were like, so we played for the same organization, but like she was on a higher team because of my age. Yeah. I don't know, because I'm six months older than her, so it made it like weird because so, like, of how she was on age varsity and I was on junior varsity. Yeah. But I think we were both team A of both varsity. Teams, yeah, we were. So. Because we were the oldest of the. I don't know. See, so it didn't make like, It didn't. Right. It, Homeschool sports is really confusing and complicated until you're in them. You know what I mean? You have yeah. to be in them for to understand it, but once you're outside of it, you're like, oh, shit, I don't even know how to explain it to you. You have <laughs> right. to be in it to understand why it works this way. So yeah, it works. works. It doesn't okay. work. Yeah. <laughs> There's too many. I know. But basically anytime we played soccer anytime or like any soccer. practice, that was always so fun. Co-ed soccer was the best I love because we played soccer. with the dudes and they would be afraid of us because we were girls. They didn't want to like hurt us. One of these, one of the 4th of July's that we spent together, her dad was setting the fireworks off for us. And like something had, I think we had some kind of like bottle, bottle rocket, rocket type, or something. type one. And it wouldn't like stick in the ground for some reason. And so her dad was like, I'm just going to put it in, in a, a bucket. bucket. And so he lights it and runs away and the bucket falls over and shoots out towards her dad. And we're watching across the field and we're like, 
oh shit, like, oh my god, what it, the fuck? It shot towards my dad, which was also towards my grandfather's truck. Right, and, and it was trailers, like all grass and too, tractors. so like, it, it could have, I think it did catch on fire a little a bit, little just bit. like a little bit of gra uh, grass did. Yeah. And then, another 4th of July, we almost hit the woods across from my house on my Yeah, house. that was another whole explosion. <laughs> um, one day, we were, my dad was taking us to the zoo. Because we were like, oh let's just God. do something. We wanted yeah. to do something. My dad was like, oh, take me to the zoo. We were like 15 years old. We were like, why do we want to go Which, see the animals? I, I love mean, the zoo. I don't we know love what you're the zoo. About. But we were also like, we're 15 years old. Why do you want to take us to go see the fucking animals? I wasn't you? complaining. I wasn't. I, don't, I, was, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I was just like, it was weird that we were so old and he was so excited to take us to the zoo. And I was like, okay, yeah, we're going to go to the zoo. Cool. I like the zoo. I like animals. Okay. Right. Anyway, so we're on the way, and like it wasn't even it wasn't raining or anything like that. Like it was perfectly sunny outside, and all of a sudden we hear a big like Boom. something hit the window, and, I'm and like, we oh both my God. look up. And I look, we both look, and it's at the blood. same time, and we were like, like ah! and this was at the height of our supernatural like like as yeah, being like, fans. Yeah. So we were like the apocalypse, like get the salt, get the whatever, like we were holy like, Shit, oh it's my raining God. blood. Yeah, like we were like, freaking out. There was like death. this it was much of a splatter. A of blood. lot of blood. And like her dad was like, Calm down. I don't want to take you guys anymore. He like, like he didn't understand why it was a big deal. And no. I was like, because blood just fell out of the sky. I don't remember anything from the actual zoo other than getting our little moose and we named it Sam. Uh, yeah. I still have him. Hold on. I wanna get him. Meet our Sam. 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 Boop. That's Sam. Oh. <laughs> Say hello. Okay, so the joke is because in Supernatural, Boop. Crowley calls Sam and Dean moose and squirrel. <laughs> right. We couldn't find a squirrel. But we couldn't we find a squirrel. We found a moose. So we found a moose. Yeah. And... We were like, we're gonna name him Sam and he's gonna be ours. And I've had him for years. <laughs> Look how fat he is. He's I love so him. fat. I love him. He can perch on my shoulder. Okay, next. I think I'm losing my mind now. So, like we said, we're definitely gonna keep um, trying at this. And right now, the equipment we have is literally a light, a bed sheet, and an iPhone. Yeah. So. And this is like not even a real light. It's. It's a side lamp. It's two side lamps that are LEDs. Yeah. So. So. But we are trying to film once or twice a week and upload once or twice a week. Once or twice a week. <laughs> Our upload dates are going to be Thursdays and Sundays, and we're going to try and keep that consistent. <laughs> but like we have said, she's starting business school. I'm working and I'm probably about to get a full-time position so yeah we're gonna try and like best. even um like a couple weeks ago we just couldn't film one day because yeah. my art my car was out of commission uh, there's just so much shit we, like, were, we ended up having to work yeah. like all this stuff was happening and so we just couldn't film and then it's we got lucky that we could film this week this week so because I'm leaving for the beach and you'll get and I started working this week so yeah so that's fun hey but okay, within the next six months, oh yeah, we're definitely. I think the, the light is next, mm -hmm. and then um, hopefully the light is gonna have a stand. Yeah, you know. Um, and then next will be at like least, an editing software too. Yes, and then at least like a, a green or like blue sheet, or more like a different background. Yeah, for sure. And then we'll probably start paying monthly on a editing software until we want to buy it yeah. outright. Um, and then for Christmas, we're probably gonna get a camera, a uh, Canon. So some sort of Canon. Some I don't know. We're gonna figure it out. We have six months to figure that out. So. And obviously, we're trying to save money for this channel as much as possible. But you know, we both um, have, to have lives, and right? And so. Um, Right. And we're definitely going to try to go like on trips and stuff like that too, like just go out of our city and stuff. But like you said, it depends on our schedules and money. And we have about, we have, we have for sure up until September planned out. And then we have ideas thrown in for October, which we're doing a little October special for you guys. So stay tuned for that. We'll explain more in September about that. For sure. Um, okay. And then we might uh, try Vlogmas, or at least a version of it, too, yeah. so watch out for that. So we might try Vlogmas, or at least a week of Vlogmas, to kind of show, like, finals versus, like, retail right. in 
Christmas time because like and it'll be waitressing during that time too yeah, so. so it'll just be it'll be hell for both of us yes. but we'll try and bring you guys along <laughs> Hopefully, like comedic lifestyle. lifestyle. We want it. We want to appeal to anybody. Yeah, is the thing. And like our first video was commentary, and then we did a challenge. You know, and then, so we're yeah. just trying. We're trying a little bit of everything. You know, we have some vlogs. We have Q and A. You know, we just did. Yeah, trying it off. We're trying it off. Been a savage. Rolled every swisher that's in the package. Um, tenacious. <laughs> Bold. Bold. Okay. Dramatic, <laughs> loyal, and funny as fuck. So yeah, so yeah. Um, well that's about us. Yeah. Um, we get this video like a little long, but you know we just wanted it to be personal. See you guys next time. Uh, like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let us know if you have anything in common or if you absolutely hate something we do. Let us know. Yeah. We're not gonna change for you, but we just want to talk about it we and talk about explain it. how you're wrong. <laughs> so, explain how you're wrong. Right. Um, and comment any other questions that you'd like to. Yeah, and then so we can start saving them for our next mm -hmm. video or maybe like a Twitter Q and A. Yeah. Like that. So thanks for watching, guys. Thanks, guys. Bye. Bye. Bye.